Touch of victims of former Chadian President Isen Abru react to the dictator's death at 79 year old in Senegal, where he was serving a life sentence for crimes against humanity. Abri has succumbed to coronavirus, according to Chad's consulate. Nothing will happen at all. The fight for compensation will continue because I believe that at the level of the African Union, the African heads of state have created a trust fund for the benefit of the victims, for the compensation of the victims of Isenabri. The International Criminal Court has ordered Abri to pay up to $33,000 to each victim who suffered rape, arbitrary detention and imprisonment during his role. As victims, we would have liked for Isen Abri to have lived a long time so he could assist with victims' compensation. It's a shame he died so early considering his life sentence. It doesn't mean he shouldn't have gone so soon, but the Lord decided so he's gone. So we mourn his death, but the struggle continues. Amen. C'est Dieu qui a décidé ainsi. Il est parti. Nous te pleurons. Son décès. After a landmark trial in Senegal, where he fled after being chased out of office by Sudan-based forces, Abri has been released. 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 Abri has been released